The following Let's Play may contain language or commentary that is not suitable for people of all ages. Not necessarily this time, but still. You know what I hate about video games? It's that you need two hands to play with the controllers, and that means I can't have one hand on my nuts. I'm Gaming Goose, and this is Let's Play. First of all, I want to say, I see everybody's little cute little ass comments about how I can improve or what I need to do to uh, advance in the stage and all this stuff. I want you to know, I got it covered. What movie is that from? I got it covered. I know what I'm doing. So I'm cool. I don't need your advice. And while I appreciate it, let me play the game. Like I said, go live your life. If you got something better to do, go. Go do it. Beat it. Have fun. Have a blast. I also see some of you think you're fucking comedians out there with your cute little jokes and your uh, sassy little comments there. Come on, Darth. Um, making jokes. I'll leave the fucking jokes to me. All right. That's the way I like it. I do want to clarify something. You know what? I fucking give up. I fucking give up on life. I give up on trying to entertain anybody. I give up on this. Uh, you know what? YouTube is probably the most worthless fucking thing on an, an invention on the planet. You know what? Chen and Chode, whoever the hell their fucking names are, are, are fucking genius bastards. They got a $12 billion company that is filled with copyright infringement and shit. Because that's all that's on this goddamn fucking Forsaken channel. 95% of it. If you look at the top 10, there is shit, shit, and more shit. There's nothing up there. There's, there's fucking Lonely Girl 15, those two little fucking queer bait sma smosh guys. And you know what? I'm not saying there's anything wrong with being gay, but those little guys, they're not funny. That's what's most wrong with smosh. If they've ever made me laugh. If I could, if I could explain to you, the secret to the key of the universe is to why when... Smosh is trying to be serious, they make me crack up, and when they're trying to be funny, they keep me straight faced. But I tell you, there's some there's some time flux capacitor in there. So yeah, there's nobody interesting in the top ten. This is a channel full of shit. And I just give up. I give up, what the fuck? And I'm not saying I'm trying to be interesting or anything else. You know what? I can't believe I just lost that goddamn Come here, R2 taking on my aggression on you. You are my bitch. Excuse me, Gaming Goose. That promotes violence against women. That is not very... T you know what? Shut up. This is a non-PC correct zone. And look at me. I'm arguing with myself. I do have to clarify something. I think in one of the last ones I said that young women or women didn't know what they were doing uh, when it comes to having sex. I didn't mean to imply that boys knew what they were doing either. I mean, let's be honest with you, uh, with ourselves here for just a moment, please. Um, dogs can figure out how to get it in the hole faster than a 16-year-old boy. Okay? Trust me on that. Wait a minute. You know what I'm saying, goddammit. Not that I have any experience with 16-year-old boys trying to get things in holes. Not real time, anyway. No, but I'm being serious. They have no fucking clue what's going on. They like to act like it is. And it's such a double standard. How stupid are we? And the reason why is it, the reason why women are more self-conscious in bed because this retarded ass double standard that we have when it comes to appearances. Because dudes can look like ass, and women got to go through fucking hoops and ladders and all kind of shit just to look good. And it's such a goddamn double standard. And it's a double standard to the point where you stop coming back up there, electric dildo. And it's such a double standard to the point where you have a freaking music video show, Britney Spears comes out looking probably better than uh, most people uh, that you know, and she gets shit for it. Granted, she looked high, but that's all right. Everybody, you know, everybody's high. You think when fucking P. Diddy or 50 Cent tries to talk that they don't sound and look high? You don't come up with your name as P. Diddy if you're not high? Why does she get shit for it? Anyway, where was I? I lost track of my rant. It'll come back to me. Just give me a minute. 
Just give me a fucking minute. So anyway, it's a double standard and shit like that. And she comes out and she gets shit for looking stupid in this one. When I tell you something, the, she, she looked she looked way dumber kissing Madonna than she did this fucking performance. Because Madonna is a fucking embarrassing slut that should have been off my planet a long time ago. Fucking Planet Eric should be a Madonna-free zone. She's such a fucking pompous... Her face has has the fucking look of, I am so perfect, and... and she got that fucking look, a condescending look of fucking pompous... Ew! You just want to sit there and just fucking bust a nut, and just fucking... Bleh! Not me, because, you know, I'm not into that kind of stuff. But if but if I were, I'd want to fucking just break it right on her face. You know what I'm saying? Just fucking, just a big old fucking brick. Like a goddamn fire hose. Like, when I let go, it would just be like... <laughs> be full of fucking wind and, um, fucking gush. It would be like a fucking bomb exploded. That's what it would be like. Get over there. Oh man, I only got two things left. Vit, vit, vit yourself. I mean, come on, she got them fucking eyebrows that don't even match her fucking face. Number one. You know? And, um. Oh, this floor is moving. Um. I'm in uncharted territory. Die. Oh! Arr! Ooh, I thought that wasn't going to stop there for a minute. Haha. -ha. Um, so yeah, she got that stupid face and um, her stupid eyebrows that go up to her head. You know what? Someone just needs, someone needs to take pompous people in fucking Hollywood and just show them a thing or two. And when see fucking Paris Hilton go on there and David Letterman talk to her, it's all over YouTube, or at least it was. Go fucking Google it. Or YouTube it, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Um, of Paris Hilton on on David Letterman, he's asking her about jail, and she's like, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, and I'm stronger for it. Oh yeah, that's why you're sitting there going, mommy, 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 don't make me fucking be a human being. <laughs> oh jeez, you know what I can't understand? Is there some kind of taboo in Hollywood that she's a goddamn billionaire and she can't afford a driver? The problem is he's gonna have to cut her in on the, on the fucking coke. What's the problem here? I don't understand it. Like, why would you drive anywhere, dumbass? And I and what is it with this stupid power in that? I can't even get through. That fucking pisses me off. This fucking waiting thing. Now I gotta fucking sit here. I was talking about Paris Hilton and her fucking ham sandwich. I was talking about Donna and her fucking dried crusted up ham sandwich. You know what? I wish her poon was a snail. Then I could drop fucking drop a fucking just like a fucking ton of salt on it. 